الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد أيها الأحباب أهل السنة والجماعة We believe in the scale as a part of our creed the scale that our deeds will be weighed on the day of judgment and in a sahih hadith of the Prophet alayhi salatu wa salam inna samawati ya sada wa ardiyina sada lo wudiyat fi kifa wudiyat la ilaha illallah fi kifa rajahat bihinna la ilaha illallah the Prophet alayhi salatu wa salam said in a hadith in sahih أخرجه بخاري في أداب مفرد وأحمد في مسند. He said صلوات ربي وسلامه عليه. Verily the seven heavens and seven earths, if they were put on a the hand of the scale and لا إله إلا الله was put on the another hand of the scale, then لا إله إلا الله would be heavier than them. Sheikh <coughs> Sheikh uh, Abdulaziz al-Rajihi, Hafidhullah Ta'ala, one of our mashayikh in Riyadh, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala preserve him, mentioned in explaining this, and this is in Shara uh, Asul al-Sunnah, Imam Ahmed, he said, لَكِنْ مَا الَّذِي يُوزِنْ فِي هَذَا الْمَيْزَانِ He said, what will be weighed on this uh, the scale? And then he says, Al Jawab, the answer. Tuzin fihi a'mal, wu yuzin ashkhas. Fa tuzin al a'mal, fa tukun hasanat fi kifa, wu sayyat fi kifa. Fa men thakalat mawazinuhu, naja, wu sa'd. Wu men khaffat mizan hasanatuhu, wu thakalat mizan sayyatuhu, halak. So then the Shaykh said, Hafidhullahu ta'ala, he said, the answer to that of what is going to be weighed on this scale on the day of judgment he said our deeds will be weighed on the scale of judgment on the on the day of judgment on the scale and uh individuals and he said to uh that weighing the deeds between those deeds it will be the good deeds Hasanat will be weighed on one um, one hand of the scale. I'm not sure what we say a kifa, one uh, part of the scale that holds that measures that holds measurements, and the sayyat fi kifa, and his and the wicked deeds will be on the other uh, scale, on the other um, hand of the scale. So whoever's scale. Uh, becomes heavy with the righteous deeds, with the good deeds, then they will be successful and they will be happy and content. And whoever scale weighs, uh, whoever's hand of the scale that weighs very light with good deeds, meaning that they have very few good deeds, and the their hands of uh, the the hand of measurement or the unit of measurement is very uh, heavy with wicked deeds with bad deeds then they will be destroyed halak and then he mentioned the statement of Allah Azza wa Jal وقال الله تعالى فأما من ثقلت موازينه فهو في عيشة راضية وأما من خفت موازينه فأمه هاوية وما أدراك ما هي Narun Hamiya in Surah Al Qariya. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, فَأَمَّا مَنْ فَقَلَتْ مُوَازِنُهُ Then as for him whose measure of good deeds is heavy, فَهُوَ فِي عِيشَةِ الرَّاضِيَ He shall live a pleasant life. وَأَمَّا مَنْ خَفَّتْ مُوَازِنُهُ And as for him whose measure of good deeds is light, فَأُمُّهُ هَاوِيَ His abode shall be the abyss. وَمَا أَدْرَاكَ مَا هِيَ and what will let you know what it is, what, what this abyss is? Narun uh, Hamiya, a burning or blazing fire. So Ayyul Ahbab, strive your best to do righteous deeds and do be away from sinfulness and cover up your 
evil deeds with something good. And belief, as it is the belief and creed of Ahl Sunnati wal Jama'ah, as Allah Azza wa Jal revealed to us, or revealed to His Prophet alayhi salatu wa salam, and as the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam had it revealed to him and articulated that we believe in the mizan, we believe in the scale on the Day of Judgment, and that this is from the creed of Ahl Sunnati wa Jama'ah. This is what the Salaf of our Ummah believed, and this is what the Tabi'een uh, are those who followed them in righteousness up until now and until the Day of Judgment. This is the belief of Ahl Sunnah. And may Allah bless us with tawfiq to be from Ahl Sunnah. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.